that are, say, at shoulder height. They're getting them off the rack, and then they're all still on one side of the boat on their shoulders. How would you, I mean, I would normally recommend that, that two people go under so that, right. and as you're taking it out, you're, you're already s yeah. split. So that, so that when you get out into the center of the bay, you have, say, a safer quad, you have two people on the port side, two people on the starboard side. Is there anything, is, would you agree with that? Or? I would agree with that. I know how we always did it was, um, like, like Jim said, as you're taking it out, and this is something you can communicate beforehand, who's going to go to what side, but kind of go to that side as you're taking it out. I know that here we do a lot of, you, you take it off all, like, all on one side, which gets a little bit awkward, and then you go up over heads and then down. It works, but then there's always that increased risk of as you're taking off, racking up everyone on one side, and no real support on the other side. So if it is possible, yeah, communicating is ahead of time, and obviously with our racks, you can't all go under right away, because there's usually another boat there, but as you're taking it off, I would agree really have. So maybe like two and three, maybe like bow and stroke would stay on the outside, and two and three, or whatever you agree to, they would go under as you're taking it off, so that you don't want it in the middle of the day with four people on the Yeah. The same, I would say, with when it's at waist height, when you're taking it off, I know we have like, you're holding the boat like this, and then you have two people go under. Usually, I would say the safer thing is to at least have two people, if there are two people to help, go at the end, because it's a lot lighter to lift it both from the end rather than in the middle. So as two people are going under, have that extra support at either end. It's a lot to hold the boat awkwardly like this. <coughs>